We have uh, Norman Desmond here with us. Norman, how are you this morning? You can call me Mr. Desmond. <laughs> yeah, you wanted success, Mr. Desmond. And uh, to be frank, you wanted fame, money, girls? I had success and money, plenty of it. You mean with your hit song, The Letter, from the time with Fox Tops? Right. Well, what are those days of rock and roll like? The early days, I mean. Pretty scummy. <laughs> I don't know. Better scummy as now. Really? It was a hard life out on the road and all. Not as glamorous as it seems then. But all you wanted from Big Star was to be famous. Were they the correct things? The music, I could take it or leave it, you know. But despite your fame and all that, you just couldn't help but write the best love songs, could you? <laughs> it's my curse, you know. What can I do? Uh, for you. Exactly. People have been telling me that I've been wrong every step of the way. And in retrospect, it doesn't look like I was so wrong after all. I mean, absolutely. You started at the top and decided success on your own terms. Uh, after all this time and having done your solo work, uh, how does it feel to have the band back again? Uh, it's... I don't know. I don't have anything to say. <laughs> really? Nothing? Um, well, in the time since, releasing records with Big Star, you've managed to gather yourself quite the, you know, cult following, shall we call it. Uh, will you be continuing the show with Big Star, or, you know, I mean, audiences seem to be loving it. Uh, no. Where are you living these days? <laughs> About a mile or so down that way. No, you say. Uh, no, well, why is that? Uh... I don't know. I don't even want to think about it. You're living in London now, then, are you? Oh, no. I'm just... I've got to keep them guessing, you know. <laughs> right. Uh, is there any chance of one more big star show? Can't think of one. Just a lot of fun out there today, then. Right. I was... Uh, I was... I mean, I was glancing through a rock and roll publication called Egg World the other day, and the new album is being labeled the Album of the Year. You're receiving an awful lot of critical acclaim. The album's really good. Yeah, it's, uh, it's nice. I just hope it sells. We've had critical acclaim before. We've done it. Mm. What's next on the agenda for today? You guys hit some, hit some bars, celebrate the end of the tour? When you're not a drinker, a bar gets old in about 15 minutes. Perhaps that's more true of places that don't have music. The thing is, 30 minutes of anybody is plenty for me. I, I don't care if it's Beethoven playing with Bach. After 30 minutes, I'm going to get bored and split. I'm sure you've got plenty more interviews to get through, Norman, so I won't keep, keep you much longer. No, it's, this is it. I uh, don't get off on doing interviews generally. Uh, a lot of interviewers have their heads up their asses. Present company not included, of course. <laughs> but a lot of them do. Plus, if I granted all of them, I'd be doing this all day long. Yeah. Well, Norman, thank you very much. You're right. I left with my aunt. Did someone grab that? Could someone? All right. Thank you. I was in Japan, and uh, a fan gave me this spoon. It was a special kind of spoon. Uh, um, I used it all the time, and I always used to take it everywhere with me for some But uh, the spoon had an engraving on it, and I didn't have any Japanese friends to tell me what it was. But uh, what's funny, a few years later, I went back to Japan, and they confiscated it at the airport for what it said. What did it say? Well, you can't have it in your interview. They won't let you show it. <laughs> I'm sure we can believe it if it's not too bad. Well, I get to the airport and they're checking everything. And this young attendant looks at the spoon and uh, turns white and confiscated it. I asked them what it meant, but all the girls went red and all the boys went white. <laughs> <laughs> you want to know what it was? On camera, 
I only found out from this old lady. She was the only one who seemed to find it funny. Oh, uh, yeah? What, well, go on. What did it say? <laughs> it said... <laughs> Does this show go out in Japan? No, I'm, I'm not sure. I think so. <laughs> time to do a little number for us? Oh, uh, sure. Uh, but I'm not going to sing, if that's all right. You oh, still want to do a number, all right? Yeah, go for it. Go for it. Do an old one.